Hello, I'm James Buscard, CEO of Nevada Exploration, and today we're pleased to present an updated geologic model from our South Grass Valley Carlin Type Gold Project, situated within the larger Grass Valley south of Nevada Gold Mines Cortez Complex. The main features that define this newly discovered and otherwise blind mineral system continue to be a thick sequence of lower plate bedrock containing a highly permissive host unit called the Hales that sits under a less reactive cap rock, the Goodwin, that has been broken by the complex and deep-seated water canyon structural corridor along the margins of the Jurassic Age Grass Valley stock. Where these features come together at the project, we see evidence for carlin-type mineralization in the highly anomalous gold and pathfinders in groundwater, as well as in the soils in the northern part of the project, where the Hales formation comes closest to the surface, which is also the area where we've encountered the most extensive and intense silicification in our drilling to date. While other projects in Nevada exhibit many of these same ingredients, what we believe underpins the significance of this project is its scale, which is directly comparable to the mineral systems responsible for Nevada's three largest Carlin-type districts, each of which hosts more than 50 million ounces of gold. We've just completed core hole 14 at the project, as well as the top half of core hole 13, and with each new piece of data, we're seeing more and more evidence that the dominant control for the flow of mineralizing fluids through the system were structurally related, and that these are likely more important for controlling the distribution of mineralization than the lateral flow paths through the host rocks themselves. This recognition has driven a year-long relogging initiative to update our geologic model, the results of which we've released today. With a now improved understanding of the location and nature of the major structural features across the project, we are using our updated model to target our next drill holes in the places of highest potential, specifically in areas where these structural features intersect the hails, which we plan to further prioritize based on where we expect the hails has been brought closer to the surface in order to minimize our need for deeper drill holes. The model is now available on our website at nevadaexploration.com and we invite you to review each of the data layers including the assay results from all drill holes received to date as well as deposit footprints of other important Carlin deposits for scale. So be sure to stay tuned and thank you for watching.